in this video I would like to introduce the collection behind me, describe the reasons what we made it for and talk about the challenges we faced during COVID-19 time. So as you can see, uh, there are only case goods without beds or any other items. And the reason why we designed and produced this collection is to match it with the upholstered beds, which usually coming from Malaysia. Malaysia is strong for upholstered beds. And when our customers buy the beds, usually they just buy the beds alone without any bed sides. And we decided to develop a collection which will be matching those beds. Uh, when it comes down to bed side, it's a either round bed side with one drawer or uh, a bed side with three drawers. It's not fully rounded, it's just rounded on the sides. Uh, same with the case goods, with the dresser and tall boy. Also, the way we've picked the color is that this color will go well with the gray color and the blue color, which is trendy at the market now. One of the biggest challenges with these items are coming here on the banded parts. First of all, for a factory to do it, it's either they need to have a proper press with the molds and they need to create the mold for each side because they're different sizes and then you've got to have a press. In some cases, a factory can subcontract it to a smaller factory uh, just to do those parts. When you do it, you've got to have a mold and then you've got to uh, press it down and hold it in the mold for a while. So when it comes down to big quantity, it's taking too long time. And if we are not going to follow the procedure after we take it out from the mold, it can straighten up. And it happened with our first production and we needed to put it in the mold for a couple of times. In any manufacturing process, time is money as usual and when we have a big quantity of items and not enough press and molds this is the problem especially when they bend back so by spending more time on it it's extending the production time in general which is causing the increase in the price which we cannot afford During this COVID-19 time, uh, it's a lack of materials everywhere. We need to ship the product on time and therefore we have to be flexible without sacrificing the quality. What happened on the product here? We have uh, parts in veneer and we have uh, solid wood parts. Ideally, we needed to put the veneer here on this drawer front as well, but we were running out of it and therefore we just needed to apply solid wood. The problem with the solid acacia is the notes. There are way too many notes. And originally these notes, which are still here, they were stand, standing out too much and it just looked ugly. The solution which we found is to bleach out those notes, which is usually applied for more expensive uh, types of wood. However, because we have no time and we have a lack of supply, we needed to apply that expensive technique of bleaching out the notes here which we did and now if you look at it you don't even notice the notes and that's what we did I'd like to highlight a few design features which we applied on these items and they look both natural and cool 
First of all, we applied the, this veneering pattern on the top of this one drawer bedside and it looks pretty cool. We used metal part to make the structure of this bedside stronger and it, it, it looks good in combination with the handle and it looks cool. And on the bigger case goods, on the top by Andressa, the top drawers we put veneering in the diagonal way, this way, and it also fits well in this design. Guys, if you are in furniture industry and didn't subscribe yet, please subscribe, click like, and I'll see you in the next videos.